Hello and welcome to this Minecraft and Survive Thrive series. This is going to be a Modded Survival Episode Edition. You're joining me, Matthew Land, the Technoman, for an awesome episode today. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. So we're going to be creating a new Modded Survival world, and we're going to call this... Uh, what should we give this name? We're going to call this Modded, Su Modded Survival. Let's do that. And let's start. So, we are going to convert this world into something pretty darn cool. So, what we're going to be doing... Oh, great, now I've already got encoding issues. What we're going to be doing today is we're going to start building our first... Uh, we're going to build our first proper home. And we're going to... Um, okay, we can close you for now. We are going to be building a world now. As you can see, you might experience a bit of lag because the screen capture software isn't the best that I'm using at the moment. I would have some suggestions if anyone's got something good I can use. Let's have a look at how we're doing. Turns out we're getting about 47.52. That's not bad, especially when I'm recording. Okay, we haven't got lag anymore. I'm actually watching it on two screens at the same time, just so I can see what it feels like. Okay, enough of that. We are going... Oh, a lucky block. Stand back. This might not go well. Oh, that's nice. We've got... 14 obsidian. So I'm just going to start wandering around and we're going to try and find some coal. P best place to find some is up there. But we're going to need a crafting table first. Now this is obviously something that pretty much everyone's aware of so we're going to do that. Oh I got a tomato. Now that's something you don't see in normal Minecraft is it now? Now each episode of the Minecraft Survive and Thrive will be 20 minutes long and we will um uh, pretty much start building from there. This should be a 28 episode series. If we want to do more, hit that like button and do subscribe if you want to see more episodes. So hopefully my friends will be happy today because they actually, I was like 50 likes, sorry, 50 subscribers and then I would get, I would start the series. So hopefully it doesn't look too bad on their side and the capturing software. So if I just quickly do, I'm just going to change a setting. If I do scene two, I want to view that in a full screen on display. There we go. So now I can see what I'm looking at. Okay, so you guys are... I now can see what you guys are looking at because I've just put the application in full screen. We're going to get about 10 wood because that's the best I've heard from uh, the past when I've been playing it. If you start off with 10 wood, you should be fine. Um, but the best thing what we're going to do is don't build a house straight away. We're going to set up a camp somewhere in... Um, we're going to set up camp in a, uh, well, just in a stone cave kind of thing. Okay, so that will do me. I've got enough wood for the night, and I'm going to go up to the mountains and see if I can find some coal. Oh, hello, chicken. Going to go up. Oh, sugar cave, that's very useful. Oh, sugar, as my friends would say. Or are they? Now this is not probably not the most recommended way on how to get up, but I just do it because I feel like it. Oh dear, we had a bit of a glitch there. So yes, you might get the occasional glitch, because OBS is a really b well, it's not too bad, but with the encoding settings, I'm still trying to get used to how to, to do them. Um, so, yeah, we're going to just keep going up here until I can find coal. Otherwise, I will show you another trick that I've learned, how to get charcoal instead if I can't find coal. But look at this place. So we just started over there. We literally started... Oh, never mind. Opened up my inventory. Um, I don't see any coal anywhere, and that's because we need to be looking in areas like here to find it. Oh, there's even a cave, that's clever. So what we're going to do is we're first off going to take, I'm going to take half of this, I'm going to convert it into wood, and then I'm going to take four of these, I'm going to take four of that, actually, we might, actually, yeah, I'll take four of that, ah, god damn it. And we're going to make a crafting table. So as you can see here, four oak wood planks or any type of wood. 
gives you a crafting table. So we've only got four squares, but in a second, what should happen is open it up and we now have nine squares that we can start building things. I'm going to build some sticks because we're going to make a pickaxe. Uh, at the moment, we're not going to focus on uh, anything else like swords or um, shovels because, well, we only need to, you know, build, build a hidey hole for now, I call it. Uh, as a good person I know from Paul Sir Jr. is very, very good at this. Uh, and he said, call it, uh, he called it a hidey hole, so I'm going to just, I'm going to copy him. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go up there. Probably not the best way how to get coal, but, you know, it's it's me playing Minecraft and that's what my friends want. And also I want to start a survival series. So we'll go in up here, like so. Uh, we'll we'll uh, move over here. We'll... Um, We'll uh, just do that. Okay. Get about four if you can. There we go. I've got six. Okay, so now we're going to start building our hidey hole. Um, so what we'll do there is, um, as you guys can see, oh, there's even more. Great. So we're going to start putting, we're just going to build a bit of a hidey hole for now, where we put our crafting table, um, chest, furnace, things like that. That's a lot of coal. Well, obviously we're near a mine shack, so, um, we're well not a mine shack, a, a, a cave, so we can start mining in there in the next episode. So episode two will be mining, uh, and try to find some ores like iron, and hopefully even, if possible, finding a diamond. So, um... As you guys can tell, I'm covered in coal. Literally. Okay, we've done enough digging there. So we've got about 15 coal, 17 obsidian. obsidian. I'm going to grab my crafting table, which is outside here. Um, oh, what did I just do that for? I'm going to steal my crafting table. We are going to build... Uh, now we're going to build a furnace. As you guys can see there. Beautiful. So we now have a furnace. We're going to place that there. Okay. Next off, we're going to make a door because I don't want the zombies to come and attack me tonight. So we'll do that. Now, I'm going to put it one block in because if I jump straight away, um, I'm going to hit by that. They're going to get hit by that um so next thing i think we're gonna be fine for now um i will make some torches quickly so we'll go to our crafting table two sticks like that like so as you can see i've got well let's do eight and then i could turn it into fragmented carbon now don't ask about that because yes that will be for another future episode um uh, probably not in this series though, who knows. Hit that like button if you want to keep seeing more of these episodes. Let me know in the comment section below. I would appreciate that. So we're going to also now build a pickaxe. We're going to also build um, a sword because I would rather have one. And finally, okay, we're going to need another stick. Like that, and then I'm going to build also an axe. Okay, oh, there goes my stuff. So, let's see how we're looking. It's still not dark, we have our hidey hole for now. It's really small, but we can, you know, continue mining and things like that if we wanted to. Uh, oh, don't drop my torches. That was silly of me. Um, and then we're going to go in here like so. Now, tip of advice. Don't dig any further than this. And you might be asking why. Well, this block here is actually dirt. Obviously, it's dirt. But as you can see here, this is actually relating to the uh, to outside. I'll show you. So if I was to dig there, I would be literally hitting that block because I'd get caught. Uh, sorry, it would ex be exposed. I would expose the hidey hole, um, as you can see there. Oh, we had a bit of lag there again. So we'll just fill that in before um, well, I get caught. 
So next thing is we're going to try and make an entrance out here so we can actually survive and I should be using a shovel for that because pickaxes are designed for other things like that. So I will build a shovel. And there we have it. Your basic tools. Um, you could use a hoe as well, but we're going to use iron for that eventually. We're going to, I'm going to, we're going to do quite a few uh, episodes regarding on how to do modern survival, including potentially helicopters, if this series cracks off with a hit. So, as you can see, I've got snowballs now. Now, before we lose our hidey hole, what I've done is I've installed a little mod that will show me where the ha where my hidey hole is. So we're going to actually do that right now. So we're going to map it. Okay, that's very weird. Um, you guys can't see it. I can't see it. That is very weird. Okay. Hang on a sec. Uh, as you can see, it should come up, but obviously it hasn't. If I do that. Oh, okay, that does work now. Cool. I just put it in full screen. Nice. So, in that case, because I can't put a, um, should I be able to, it just doesn't load it yet. Alright, so that's very weird, but what we're going to do is, instead we'll just make a beacon with a torch on it. And that is the best option you could do. Um, oh, I keep dropping my torches. And, we. Oh dear, something just dropped on the computer. Okay, and as you guys can see, it's starting to turn down to nightfall, and I'm gonna, while I'm at it, I might as well just make another good entrance point without breaking it into my own home. Or, well, not really home, I'll call it a hidey hole or bunker. Something that's not your, your actual home. Okay, some other things to note, while I'm on this series is um, we have water here, which will be great for doing lots of projects with that. Uh, we're in a snow kind of biome. Um, actually, you know what? While I'm at it, I might as well just take all of this down. This is going to get in the way. Um, so we'll take that all down. And actually, I've just realised you guys can't hear any of this because, well, actually, I've, I've muted it in OBS because um, there was no apparent reason why it should, you guys should be listening to it. But now I've actually realised why. Um, but... It's fine for now. In the next episode, I will I'll be finding a better screen recorder. Um, and also trying to make this episode a little bit more fun. Okay, we had some extreme lag there. I'm just going to do that. And I'm actually going to fill this hole in as well. Ooh, because I want as much space. Now, this fortunately is unlimited in space. And we're going to try and dig it a little further in. Um... And this will be for the next episode. So while we're digging, I'm just going to simply dig here. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode very shortly for our next episode. Where we're going to be going mining. Um, and there's two options that we're going to be doing. Uh, there's a simple one where the typical mining is where you go down one block uh, and dig. Um, like, for instance, if you wanted to do that. Down, down, down. You do it the good old-fashioned, you know, stairway type or you can do the good old-fashioned method which I like doing which is going outside into a cave and mining that way it's way easier to get your resources and here we go guys this is episode one thank you guys for joining me and yes before you ask I'm a massive fan of Dan TDF goodbye